What if I told you one of the most important scientific revolutions of the 20th century was sparked not by Einstein, Feynman, or Hawking, but by a quiet British woman mathematician whose name almost no one remembers? Her name was Mary Cartwright and she saw chaos. Long before the world even had a word for it, this is her untold story. Mary Lucy Cartwright was born in 1900 in Northampton, England. The world she entered wasn't one that welcomed women into science. Mathematics at the time was considered a man's domain, a world of chalk-dusted professors, closed circles, and locked doors. But Mary had something most of them didn't, a burning, relentless curiosity. As a child, she devoured numbers the way other children devoured stories. She loved puzzles, the elegance of logic, the way problems could be untangled like knots. Her teachers quickly noticed this girl wasn't just good at math, she was gifted. In 1919, she entered Oxford University, and there she did something extraordinary. She became the first woman to earn a first-class degree in mathematics at Oxford. Think about that centuries of tradition. Thousands of men and then Mary, one woman breaking the barrier. But success didn't mean recognition. Mary knew she would have to work twice as hard to be taken seriously, and so she did. In the 1930s, she began studying nonlinear differential equations, mathematics that describes how things move, grow, and change when life gets messy. It wasn't glamorous work. Most mathematicians avoided it. It was unpredictable, unstable, impossible to tame, but Mary leaned in. She had the patience and a vision to see beauty where others saw only disorder, and then came the war. World War II was raging across Europe, Britain needed science to fight, and Cartwright found herself drawn into a strange collaboration, one that would change history. The British Air Ministry was struggling with a problem, radar systems, their most vital defense against German bombers, weren't working properly. The radar waves were being disrupted in ways no one could explain. The mathematics behind it was breaking down, so Mary Cartwright was called in. And she began analyzing the equations that described radio and radar waves. What she found shocked her. Instead of neat, predictable solutions, her equations produced wild, chaotic oscillations. Tiny changes in input, a small shift here, a tiny variation there led to huge, unpredictable differences in output. It was as if the system had a mind of its own, unstable, unruly, chaotic. Working with physicist J. E. Littlewood, Mary explored this strange world. Together, they published papers describing what would later be recognized as the foundations of chaos theory. Decades before the world was ready, Mary Cartwright had glimpsed the mathematics of unpredictability. Today, Chaos theory explains weather patterns, stock markets, population growth, even the beating of your heart. It underpins modern science in ways we are still discovering. And yet, when Mary first presented her findings, the world barely noticed. She didn't fight for attention. She didn't crave the spotlight, she simply kept working. Quietly, steadily, brilliantly, but even in obscurity, Mary Cartwright was unstoppable. She became the first woman to serve as president of the London Mathematical Society. She became the first woman to be honored as a dame in mathematics. And in 1969, she received the Sylvester Medal, one of the highest honors in mathematics. Slowly, the world began to see what it had missed. That this quiet, determined woman had helped lay the groundwork for one of the most powerful ideas in modern science. But here's the haunting truth. Even today, outside the world of mathematics, almost no one knows her name. Ask the average person who discovered chaos theory, and they'll mention Lawrence and the butterfly effect. But long before Lawrence, there was Cartwright. Mary Cartwright lived to be 97 years old. She witnessed the rise of computers, space exploration, nuclear power, and the internet. And she lived long enough to see chaos theory finally embraced by the scientific community. Imagine that spending your life studying something the world ignored, only to watch it become one of the most revolutionary ideas of all time. Mary once said, if you've done good work, it's nice if people can see it.
But if they don't, the work is still good. Her life was proof of that. This is the untold story of Mary Cartwright, the woman who saw chaos before the world even knew its name. If you believe hidden geniuses like Mary deserve to be remembered, then hit like, share, and subscribe.